Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. Excuse my face, I haven't actually started getting ready yet, but I just chose my outfit for now. It's a Tuesday, which is my day off. Ignore the dress on the mirror, but this is what I'm wearing at the moment. Denim shorts and this top. It's kind of a bit baggy. It's for a six-year-old, so it's tight up here and loose, I don't know. But look, guys, my nails match, so I think it's a sign that I should wear it. I'm watching Jade the Libra today. Whilst I get ready, let me pause it. Halloween decor hunting in July. I, I love watching these videos, guys. They're all in America, so they're shopping in like home goods, and I'm like, oh my god, I'm obsessed with Halloween and Halloween decor. So we're gonna do a bit of that today. I'm going shopping and I'm also going to the beach. So I'll vlog. I'm just gonna start getting ready. Excuse my unmade bed in the background, I haven't made it yet. Yeah, you don't care really. I'm just putting on a little bit of hyaluronic acid by The Ordinary and then I'm going to use Simple Moisturiser with SPF in it and then I'll tell you the plan for the day. Before I tell you what I'm going to do today, I'll tell you some updates. So I've been to New York since I last posted, which, oh my gosh, it was so amazing, guys. Uh, maybe I'll insert a few clips now. <laughs> Hey guys, we're just about to go on a cruise. It's like a sightseeing cruise. We were gonna go on this one for two hours, which was like the best places of New York, going under all the bridges and stuff. But we're cheap mystic, kind of embarrassing, but it's alright. We had a Starbucks instead and went into the mall. Um but yeah, now we're gonna go on this cruise. I get some footage. I might look really weird in all these videos because I'm so cold, guys. They're only freezing. And um, I have my feet hurt so much from all this walking around. I've had to buy backless shoes that look like slippers. I'm actually digging them. Let me show you. Hey! Like, it's not like a van slipper. It's like. It's God, we're about to go up there. I'm not even kidding. Sightseeing trip. <laughs> Me and my mum have been in our gardening era, and when I say we are growing pumpkins, guys. So I was gonna wait and just show you like a reveal outside, but I'll show you once I finish getting ready. They have grown huge not even huge pumpkins but like the actual plants are going crazy the reason we've done this is because we are actually obsessed with halloween if you didn't know and you know why not take it that step further and grow our own pumpkins so they don't have to buy it from the stores we planted around 200 seedlings and i think we're gonna probably have i don't know ha like 50 pumpkins to be honest that doesn't sound like that much but then sometimes they're a woman pump pumpkin and sometimes they're a man pumpkin and they've got genders i don't know it's kind of weird um, but... i'm just curling my eyelashes but so what i want to do today is Finish getting ready. Me and my mum are gonna walk down to the beach. We're gonna get bags and bags of sand to put underneath our pumpkins because at the moment they're all, all laying on grass and pumpkin on grass is more likely to rot. So if you put sand underneath, it can like drain through and hopefully then we get like really healthy pumpkin. Just finished my mascara, but then I'll come home. Probably change it to another outfit. Then I'm gonna go into town. I'm going to have a look in TK Maxx and take you along. We'll see if we can find any Halloween decorations. Then I'm gonna see if I can thrift anything good. Um, just go into some of the shops. I'll take you around with me. We'll see what we can find. I'm not sure at the moment, but that's all I've done so far is concealer and mascara. And I'm thinking a little bit of blush. What do you think? I'm gonna use liquid blush, this blush, in fact. MUA Makeup Academy blush. My sister gave me this because she didn't like it and I like it so that's all that matters. It kind of reminds me of a paint, I feel like an artiste, so I'll just dab it on these two fingers and then I have to go really quick so it doesn't dry. What do you think? 
Is that good? Okay, I'm just gonna brush my hair and then I'll be Guys, able to do it. at the beach and we've just gotten some bags of sand. We're not filling them up too high because otherwise they'll be really heavy. This is what's gonna go underneath our um, pumpkins. So yeah, I'm gonna show you too much of each. We've got this one to do. What we do first is cut the grass around him because the grass is what's keeping all the moisture and attracting all the wood louse that are gonna eat the pumpkin. Now we're going to put lots of sand underneath him. So when it rains and the rain falls on the pumpkin, it will drain right through the sand. It won't sit underneath it. Do you think that's enough? Okay, great. Thanks to my mum, great recording skills. So that's what we're going to do for all of our pumpkins, guys. But now I'm going to go upstairs and get changed to go into town. I ended up changing my top because I was feeling very Barbie and that top wasn't bright enough for me. But now we're going to go to town. I just came in and ate a half-eating baguette. And it's got Marmite in it, but I think I'm going to wear this top with the same shorts. This is just from Hollister and I actually got this in New York. I haven't worn it yet, so I'm excited. Right, this is the outfit. Blue shorts and my yellow top. So I'm going to go now. So they've got autumn soap dispensers so far. Not sure what else they're gonna have. Oh, look at this bird feed guide. I love their outdoor stuff in Tico Mac. Oh my gosh. The first bit of Halloween, guys. So, got some pillows. These are nice. Not so much my vibe though. Oh my gosh, I love these. It's definitely my mum's style. Let's see how much are these. 10 pounds. Not oh, cool this, guys. I know it's a candle, but I wouldn't burn it. I'd keep it as display. Like a cable knit pumpkin. How much is this? Eight pounds. Guys, my mum makes these, and to be fair, they look a lot better, but we need to get some of these stalks for our ones, I This think. is only ten pounds, which is really good. They've got it in black and white, and a little sparkly one. Pretty disco they've ball. They've got a big... Oh, what the hell's inside of that? As I was saying, they've got a lot of these... What are they even called? I've forgotten. This is so nice. I'm going to test this one. Monster Fright, it's got that on top. <sighs> That's unreal, it's must eat apples. It doesn't actually see the scent, which is a bit weird. This is seven pounds. Okay. Mm, it doesn't smell like jack o' lantern. It doesn't smell like jack o' lantern. We've got some sparkly pumpkin, well, not sparkly, what are these called? Chrome pumpkins. I like this guy, he's kind of weird. Pumpkin head. And mm, they've got a lot of these, like, sort of snow globes. Oh, I don't like all of this stuff. It's that in Encanto, isn't it? Not a big fan. My goal for this year is to get a spooky blanket. So let me know, guys anywhere you've seen halloweeny blankets that are pink coloured so they go in my room because so i'll probably keep them out all year round because that's just my vibe i like this little skull one not really my room but he's got pink on him which is good but all the blankets are nearly 14.99 i really like this one they've got loads to be honest but this one i don't like that one um this one, skull, and some okay, snakes. If you're not also into Halloween and you just like autumn, that's fine because they also have some of that. Not as much, but we've got some pillows. How much is these pillows? I like this one, two velvets. 16 for two. Ooh, maple cider, maple cider. I like this lid. Smells nice, but it smells a bit like a maple cider soap. My mum really likes these acorns. I think they're made out of wood. Yeah, soapy. Have a smell. Guys, it's a different day. Oh my god. 
This is so me. I can't believe I just found this, guys. Back in TK Maxx, what can I say? This is my outfit. Love it. Black hairband. Love this. This is so vintage, guys. And also, I love these. Like a leaf. Oh, that's so nice. I love. Also, I love this. If you know, you know. So okay, nice. guys, we're in the car. As you can hear, it's raining. This is really setting the vibe. It's very cosy and autumnal in here. So let me give you a haul of everything I got today. It's actually a different day from the videos you saw in TK Maxx, but I'll give you the haul now. So I got this gorgeous chrome. Some people may say dancer. I say it's a gymnast doing a backwards kick. It's very rare I find gymnastics stuff. There's not that much stuff about gymnastics in shops. This is so nice. The rings on it or maybe a necklace. This is going in my room from the shop, The Works. This book, it's called From Bad to Cursed. I just finished reading Under the Spell. It's a three part series, I'm pretty sure. The other one is called Payback to Witch. Haven't read that one yet, but I'm reading this one now. It's very like grown up witchy stories. By the way, some of this stuff is from the thrift shop. My favorite thrift shop is called Mare and Foal Sanctuary. I really recommend it. I think it's only in England. Guys, if you're in England, go thrift at Mare and Foal Sanctuary. I find such good vintage pieces in there. And the people working in there are so nice. There's this lady in there. She's so lovely. This is all from Mare and Foal Sanctuary. So I got this gorgeous cropped knit jumper. Oh my gosh. I love the frill on the neck. Um, the sleeve. Let me tell you where this is from. Pretty little thing. So it might still even be on the website if you want to buy this so nice isn't it i just think this will look so good on dresses and with some like nice pleated skirts in the fall season next thing i got is this green top it's quite wrinkled at the moment but this is originally from primark but obviously i got it from the thrift a gorgeous green color it's got a scoop at the front and i really like it i think this is gonna wash up really nice next i got another item that's also from primark and guys this is still in the shops i went in primark today and this was in there but i got it for a pound it's so gorgeous like a, a leather skater skirt oh my gosh with my doc martens this autumn is gonna be unreal guys so the next thing i have is from select how nice is this it's going to be fitted it's like sort of like knit so it's very stretchy so it's going to be nice and fitted i'm thinking tucked into denim shorts it's going to look so cute i'm obsessed with everything that's got like collars i love collars so this was an instant yes for me it's got a bit of makeup around the collar it was actually on sale selector having a great sale at the moment apparently everything must go which me and my mum thought oh that must mean that they're closing they're not i don't know why they're doing this great sale but i'm not complaining i can't i'm in love okay this final thing i actually showed you in store i got it guys unreal look at this blanket i said earlier in the vlog i really want a halloweeny blanket that's like got pink on it for all year round use in my room because i like to have a bit of witchy vibes in my room all year round i mean how perfect is this so witchy and pink i'm gonna have this all year round but i'm just this is the best find ever. Only £15, I had to do it. Anyways, that's the haul of everything I got today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe down below and leave me a comment on what video you'd like to see next from me. So yeah, love y'all, bye.